Hey, what's up, YouTube? It's AFAL Man, and as I said in my last video, I ordered a case for the 1989 Batmobile, and I got one for the Bugatti. But really, these cases would work for any large Technic set or any large Lego set or whatever you want to display. If you guys have followed me for a while, you know I like to use a lot of displays. I have these up here. I just put that one together with my uh, wave I just found it in the tub and I thought you know what? I'm gonna put it on display now these you get at Hobby Lobby uh, if, and I think you can get them from a website called uh, Hobby Town USA a long time ago that's where I got a lot of those smaller ones that you see up there with the amiibo in them and they work really good they're pretty airtight and uh, you see it kind of helps with dusting you just kind of dust the case uh, I think the uh, the bigger ones, which you can see, I can kind of show you the size. I mean, you can fit. I got the VW bus in that one. You see, and, and they they even come with like uh, the box that they come in. You can cut out the back, and or you can just cut out some of the box and put it as the back. You see, I have a couple of those I uh, I did, but I think those are about fifteen, sixteen dollars. But you know, Hobby Lobby, you can get. You can get a discount. But anyways, they don't sell anything that big. And you're obviously not going to fit the large Technic cars in it. So I ordered these from uh, Olego Box. I'll put it here on the screen. It's actually a, a Russian company and or a, a gentleman in Russia who's uh, selling these. He sells them on eBay and everywhere else. And I reached out to him. He gave me a little discount. And if you guys order from his website, which I'll put a link in the description and say, hey, fall man, you get 5% off. Uh, so let's open this up. He wanted me to do an unboxing just to see how well this traveled. Uh, this did come from Russia. It took about three weeks to get here. So that's one thing to kind of keep in mind. Uh, it's not super quick because of the distance. But let's do a time lapse here at unboxing. Before you can tell you did a nice job, make sure it's going to be well-headed, you obviously don't want to get your uh, plastic this way scratched. So then it's also inside more bubble padding, which is very good. You know, that's one thing you guys remember my last video from the when I bought the 89 Batmobile. I, I had to send the box back, so it just came in a giant box. I, and, you know, whether it's Lego or ordering from Amazon... I'm noticing these companies are starting to cut corners with the shipping. Starting to just throw it in a bag or whatever they do. But, you know, as collectors, we don't want our stuff all messed up right when we get it. But I like the way he packaged this. Nice. So it doesn't get messed up. Looks like it has instructions in there on how to put it together, too. Which is handy. Like I said, I ordered two of these. They're probably pretty much identical for the larger Technic sets. There you go. You got the pieces that you use for the Batmobile and the Bugatti. All right, guys, I got it built up. I just did the uh, Batmobile for now. Uh, they're identical. Just probably the only difference is, like I said, would be these Technic pieces would be, they're probably blue for the uh, Bugatti, I'm pretty sure. But I got to say, I love it. Now, it does take up quite a footprint, but I mean, that's a large Lego set, so it takes up its own footprint. And as you saw uh, the time lapse, he's basically just build up these little Technic corners. It gives you the instructions on how to do it. Uh, pretty easy. Build two one way and then just mirror it. And what I like about it is it has Technic pieces. Let me see. Like right there. Down at the bottom. So you can see that. So it's not touching. 
you know, it's not sitting on the table itself. It's kind of got a little bit of elevation there, which, you know, I probably wouldn't stack these, but you can. I, you know, a lot of people do stack them, and that would keep it from rubbing on the top because, like, I don't know if I showed you guys, but one thing with these that I don't know if you can see it on camera, but he kind of can. When they rub, when they sit on top of each other, eventually they they rub, especially when you're taking them down and off. It gets some nice scratches in that plastic. I don't know if you can see that. You know, it's it's irritating. And one thing I did, if you might have saw in the video, I grabbed some of my wife's uh, gloves. So when I was building this, I didn't get uh, fingerprints all over it because it does come with like a, a sealant or like a plastic uh, layer on both sides. You peel that off so then it looks beautiful. So what I would say, if you guys are interested in these, you know, you might be leery because, you know, when I looked on eBay, I don't think there's anybody in the USA that sells these big, nice cases. They're all from either China or like these came from Russia. And, but, you know, you have to wait a little bit longer to get them, but they're, they're solid and they're, they, you know, you worry about shipping, but it's safe. And this top piece, it does this sit on there. You see that? But it's sitting on the walls. So it can hold all the weight. So, like I said, you could stack these. What I'll probably do is eventually maybe take down that sign and put some shelves here. And put the Bugatti and put it up on the shelves. Maybe stagger them and then I could put more, more builds here in the future. But like I said, guys... Uh, Here's his website, Olego Box. Is that how you would say that? Olego Box. Uh, check him out. I'll put a link in the description. And I would go to his website to buy because I, I did look on eBay and it's a little more expensive on eBay. Obviously, you got to pay eBay fees and everything else like that. Uh, you do. I did pay through PayPal, so you know you're protected if something happens. You can get your money back, but as long as you are patient and can wait for the shipping to come uh, he won't let you down he did a nice job of packing and these are nice cases i will put some pictures at the end of both of them when i if i get the other one built today i'll put it up there but check him out like i said comment a fall if you order from him and he will give you five percent off which well, that helps because uh, these aren't cheap I, I would say for the two of these uh, this one and the Bugatti, he cut me a deal and I think I paid like 90 bucks for the two. So, you, you know, I think one on eBay is like 65 by itself. I'm not real sure, but the, they're, they're quality and you're, you're going to spend $250 with the Bugatti $350 for a Lego set and you want to display it. This is the way to do it. And you know, he has the big one for the UCS, Millennial Falcon, all that stuff. So check him out, guys. Let me know what you think. I appreciate you watching. And as always, well, hit that thumbs up. See you in the next video. Bye. There we go. I threw the brick heads in there, too. Very happy with that.